Hello, I'm Adam with Nautel Customer Service. I'm going to do a short video today to help overcome some of the issues that can come up when trying to delete a preset. I'm running a GV10 here at the factory, but these principles should apply to all GV, NV, NV Lite, and VS series transmitters running the most recent version 4 software. I'm currently running about 8 kilowatts on a preset I have called Example, and I've decided I no longer wish to have that preset. So I'm going to go into my menu, I'm going to select Presets, and I'm going to hit Delete. Now it's presenting me with an error that says you cannot delete current settings. This happens if you have not actually loaded the preset you wish to edit into the preset editing screen. To get around that, I'm going to press Load, scroll down to select the preset I wish to edit, which is the one called Example, and press OK. We can see example is now loaded, and I can go ahead and press delete. Presented with another error that says I cannot delete an active preset. This is a safety measure designed to prevent you from deleting a preset you are actually using. So I'll just go ahead and get around that by selecting a different preset. In this case, I'll go with example 3. So now we can see example 3 is the preset that this transmitter is running. So I can go back to my menu, back to presets. I will load example into my preset editing screen and I will hit delete. I'm presented with a couple errors. One is that I cannot delete a preset used in the scheduler and the other is that I cannot delete a preset used as an audio loss action. So I'll deal with those in order. Uh, first we'll go in through the menu to the scheduler and it turns out that I had a rule in place for today that uses the preset example. So to get past that I just simply need to delete that rule. So it is now gone from the scheduler and that clears that error out. The next one was that I cannot delete a preset used as an audio loss option. Now I've just remembered that in my preset number two, if I go ahead and load it in my preset editing screen, right, now I have example number two. Under other settings, for my mod loss timeout, I had the action in place to change the preset to uh, preset example. So I'll go ahead and change that to example 3. And I will save it. So this audio loss action no longer references the preset example that I wish to delete. So I'll, now I can just go load and I can select my preset called example. And you can see the screen refreshes. If I go back over go ahead and delete it. We're presented with one final error that I cannot delete a preset used for a remote input or output. So let's go look at that one. We'll go into the menu, we'll go to remote input output. We'll take a look at my remote inputs to see if the preset example is referenced anywhere. And here it is under remote input number nine. So to free it up, I must change that to something else. I'll go with preset number three, press OK and apply. You can see it updates, and now my remote input 9 is set for preset 3. It's possible that the preset example is used as an output as well, so I'll check here too. And yep, turns out it's on output number 15. So I'll select that, I'll go ahead and scroll down and change that one to preset number 3 as well. If I hit apply, the screen refreshes, and output number 15 is now set to preset number 3. So the preset example is no longer my active preset. It's no longer referenced in the scheduler. It is no longer referenced as an audio loss option. And it is no longer referenced in a remote input or output. So if I go into menu and I go to preset and I load it up into the editing screen one final time and press OK. And if I hit delete, I'm no longer presented with any errors. I've simply asked if I am sure I wish to delete the preset example, and I am sure, so I press OK, and it has been deleted from the transmitter, and I can verify this by pulling up my preset drop-down menu, I scroll through, the preset called example is no longer there, and it has been deleted successfully. I'm Adam with Nautel Customer Service. Thank you for watching.